Welcome to The Film Fix. I'm Jonathan W. Hickman, and on this episode, we're going to take a look at a short film from Kansas filmmaker Patrick Ray. The movie is called Woman's Intuition, and following the screening of the movie, Patrick Ray is going to join us to talk about movies, making movies in Kansas, uh, his new feature, Nailbiter, as well as the short film format. And in coming weeks, filmmakers from all over the world are going to share their movies right here on The Film Fix, and they may join us and talk with us about filmmaking. So let's take a look at Woman's Intuition. Not a trace of cancer anywhere we've looked. You don't have SARS or mad cow disease either. You're perfectly healthy. Now I can keep running tests on you until we run out of diseases, or we can just cut to the chase. Why are you convinced that you're dying? Um, you're not gonna believe me. Give it a shot. Well, it's the sense that I have it warns me when danger is coming. How does it work? It's um, a sound that I hear. I've always had it, even as a kid. When the sound comes, I know something bad is on its way. It gives me time to react to the danger and save myself. I don't know how many car accidents I've avoided because of that sound, but it's not just obvious stuff like that. Once I was on a date with this seemingly great guy. But I heard the sound when he tried to take me home, so I ran. Later I found out what kind of guy he really was. Then there was this party in college. As soon as I saw the place, I heard the sound. By this time, even my friends knew to trust my instincts. That night on the news, we watched as the frat house burned down. A careless student started a fire and a lot of the kids didn't make it out in time. We never felt so lucky to be alive. So you see how I've come to trust this sense completely. I rely on it. It's perfectly rational, given your experiences. Well, I heard the sound again, but this time it was different. Instead of loud and sudden, this time it was quiet. Barely noticeable at first, but it didn't go away. I had no idea what to do. As days passed, I knew the sound wasn't going to leave me. I had to try to leave it behind. I drove for weeks, 
thinking I could escape whatever danger was coming. But no matter where I went, the sound remained, and it kept getting stronger. Even now I hear danger coming. So I thought of only one explanation for all of this. I must have a terminal disease, a danger that can't be escaped. I know, you think I'm nuts. No, I'm open-minded. There's no reason for me not to believe you. Maybe you do have a special intuition, but I do know that you're not sick. You're not in any danger. Well, how do you explain what I've been hearing then? Maybe your antenna's broken. <laughs> the truth is, I don't have any idea of how this sense of yours works. And when it comes right down to it, neither do you. There's no telling what this means. Well, so what the hell do I do? Pretend you don't have a special sense. Ignore it. How? Just live your life. And try not to get into trouble. The same as everybody else. 